This is Alyssa, also known as Mama. And, um... Welcome hey. to our channel. <laughs> um, I'm Quick Farm. And you do the, the... All the... Subscribe and... Hit the <laughs> bell button. You do it. Okay. Be sure to subscribe to our channel and hit the notifica notification button to make sure you get all the notifications on new videos. Ready? Mm -hmm. Okay. Today we are opening this package. I don't want to say unboxing because it's not a box, box. right? Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, we're just going to open up this package. It is a surprise to him. I know what's in it, um, but he doesn't. <laughs> we are learning about sharks right now in our homeschool, and this is themed towards that. Um, I purchased this through a shop on Etsy. The name of the shop is Shark Art by Clark. I'll try to leave a, a link in the description um, to that shop. The shipping was very fast on it. It took less than a week to get here. Um, and there's supposed to be some freebies included in here as well. And everything is collected off of the beaches in Florida. So, let's check it out and see what's inside here. <laughs> right? Mm-hmm. I'm watching. I'm making it. I'm packaging. Snip, snip, snip. <laughs> Can you get it? Okay. You, you know me. There you go. I'm ready. It goes a little heavy. Huh? Careful. Hold it over the table. <laughs> Give me the tape. <laughs> all right, all right. Lay it down here. Hang on. It's in a bag. All right. We have. A little card that says, thank you for your order. We appreciate your business. Shark Art by Clark. And we got a little, a little card. And then we have another business card here. Home of the original Make Your Own Shark Art Kit. There's their card. I don't know if you can see it. <laughs> but this is what most. Oh. Wind blew away our package. Yeah, so okay. these are um, shark teeth. I was just pretending I didn't know. So <laughs> <laughs> I was really just pretending I didn't know. Alright, hang on, hang on. We're gonna lose them all. <laughs> Easy. Whoa. Okay, look, you have shark teeth, puffer fish plates. What are puffer fish plates? Oh, yeah, these are maybe some stingray. And these are shark teeth. I have. If you can see me. See. We got. Here's your necklace piece. Look. This thing that goes. Look, that goes on the necklace. How do you get them? You have to put it on this end. Right here. Look at that. Get it on here. There. And here you go. Now you got your shark tooth necklace. Cool. Any small one is this kind? I'm not sure. We're gonna use some online resources to try to identify some of these shark teeth. Very short. That kind of looks like a dinosaur toenail, don't it? <laughs> What is this? A shark tooth. Mm -hmm. 
There's some in here that's uh, fossilized, so they're really, really, really old. Look at the colors on that one. Take that one out. Hmm. That one's pretty cool, and that one right there. And then these, the little card says puffer fish plates. Yeah. So we'll have to look that up too. Because we're doing sharks right now, but mm -hmm. we'll learn about that too. So we'll look those up as well. And what else? So there's supposed to be some small worn megalodon and great white shark teeth in here too. And this is how they do. They just sit in the, these just sit in the gums. Right. Like this. Right. Where's the mangoes on? I'm mm. not sure. That's what I said. We'll have to and look at this do one. Do some research on that. This one just sticks in there like that too. Okay, so we're going to use these for mm -hmm. all kinds of projects. We are going to get some plaster of Paris and make some excavation mm -hmm. kits out of them. We'll mm -hmm. put the shark teeth in there and then dig them out. Who's this? Um, we might even make some more necklaces. Um, and maybe take a few of them and put them on display and label them once we figure out what they are. <laughs> All right. So this is part of our homeschool lesson about sharks. And hopefully that'll be good. And I'm just gonna give you a handful. To look at all these. Yeah, there's a whole bunch of them, huh? I'm just gonna give you a handful of what all these shark teeth are. And then this is all good. How many do you think there are? I don't know, about 100. About 100? 100. That says approximately 130 to 140. This is your shark Plus some tooth extras. Too. This is your shark tooth, shark tooth, shark, 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 shark tooth. I see some really good ones to make necklaces out of. Shark tooth. Shark tooth, shark tooth. What do you think that one is? Shark tooth, I don't know. Shark tooth? I There's think a bunch of these shark tooths, so. I think this one may have went to this. I'm not sure. Probably wrong, but <laughs> I think it did. <laughs> yeah. Probably Maybe. broke. Probably Maybe. broke, but I know it's supposed to go like this. And how many teeth do sharks have? I don't remember. You don't remember? Mm-hmm. It's in the hundreds, ain't it? Huh? It's in the hundreds, ain't it? And they have rows of teeth. And what happens when one falls out? They have 300 teeth. Total in rows. And what happens when one falls out? I don't remember either. One from the back comes to the front, right? Yeah. Right. Yeah. What do you think? <laughs> what? So this is our shark teeth yeah. collection. Okay, I just wanted to show you um, some megalodon teeth that I've had for probably 20 years, maybe longer, um, in comparison to the ones we got today. Um, these are definitely fossilized, um, but this one, I find it's really cool because it still has the serrated edges on the teeth, on the tooth. And it's not completely smoothed out and worn like most you would find. These, but I've had these for a very long time. And then I'm not sure which ones are the Megalodon teeth and the ones we got today, 
but you can definitely tell the size difference in them. <laughs> You want a shark, please? Okay. That's a shark tooth. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. It's a broken one though. Okay. You gonna say thank you for watching? Thank you for watching and bye. And bye. <laughs> bye. Bye. <laughs> thank you for watching.